Hello everyone, welcome to Everyday Affairs, where we bring you all trending news and information on things happening around the world. I appreciate every one of you who has subscribed to this channel. However, if you're yet to subscribe, kindly click on the subscribe button on the right hand side of your screen, written in red, subscribe, and also hit the bell icon by its side so that you can get notification whenever a new story is published. Thank you and stay tuned. Headsman killings. Mieti Allah apologizes to Benue Governor Autumn. The Mieti Allah Kauta Horo, representative of headsmen across Nigeria, has apologized to the Governor of Benue State, Samuel Otom, over killings in the North Central State carried out by members of the organization. According to Al-Hassan, he and members of the group regretted the death caused by killer heads men. He vowed to work for harmonious living between headsmen and farmers in the state. The Mieti Allah scribe, who spoke at a peace meeting in Makodi, which was organized by a chairman of Air Peace, Chief Allen Onyema praised Autumn for standing for the security of his people. On his part, Autumn assured the group that the anti-open grazing bill passed by the Benue Assembly several months ago was not to attack headsmen, but to protect lives and properties of both headers and farmers. The governor said the foreign headers were unfit to have access into Nigerian territories because of the arms they carry and later used to attack communities, including those in Benue State. Autumn made the appeal on Monday, October 21st, when he visited a female victim of suspected headsman attack whose limb was amputated while working on her farm in Guma Local Government Council of Benue State. All right, readers and listeners, you've heard the news. Um, it is just um, unfortunate that even at this particular point in our nation, we are still talking about the issue of um, farmers and headers clashes. It brings um, to question the role of government, especially the federal government, as to what they are doing to tackle this um, evil menace in the society. Despite all the furore that happened uh, several months ago and uh, how people came out and um, spoke against the Ruger Bill spoke against uh, the killings and uh, the maiming of farmers by this um, headsman. It's still unfortunate to note that um, they are still rampaging the lands of uh, innocent citizens and killing farmers on their farms. However, we must give credit to the chairman and CEO of um, Air Peace in the person of Allen Onyema for uh, bringing out time and uh, for spearheading this peace meeting between the Mieti Allah Cattle Breeders Association and the government of Benue State to help bring peace to the land. This should be one of the cardinal points of the federal government, but they are lacking in this state. Uh, we must give kudos to uh, the chairman of Air Peace, who has um, shown uh, patriotism in uh, spearheading this peace meeting. However, we must call upon the government to stand on its ground and uh, bring a lasting solution to this uh, menace, as it does not represent uh, peace and it does not bring uh, good tidings to the land. All right, I'd like to hear from you what your thoughts are. Can you reach out at the comment section and let us know what your thoughts are? And please don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Thank you.